In less than a year, TV as we know it is about to change with the transition to digital. A few months ago, we started airing stories about the upcoming transition, and we even tried to answer your questions. Once again, Christian Farr joins us with the answer to one of those questions that has some viewers very concerned. Christian, what is that question? Well, that question is, will my VCR continue to work after I switch over to digital? And the answer to that question is yes. But one of our viewers, and I just want to uh, talk about him a little bit, Reese Turbin, had sent us an email and asked us to do a demonstration so people could get an idea of how this works. Because we keep talking about it, we say it works, but we don't show you how it's going to work. Will you come to my house and do this later then? <laughs> Carol, I will, I will be there on February 17th to hook it up for you. All right, how do we do it? So we're going to start here. Um, we're first going to show you, this is the digital tuner that they're selling right now on the market. This is the Insignia brand. Um, it's the house brand for Best Buy. Um, retails for $60, you have the $40 coupon, you pay 20 bucks. This is a standard VCR, and then of course we have a regular 13 inch television, nearly 20 years old. Wanted to show an older TV to let you know that you can hook it up. So I'm going to turn all of these around so we can see the, the connections on the back. And uh, basically what you're going to do is you're going to connect the converter through the VCR to the television. So we're going to turn this around as well, Carol. Yeah, got it. Thank you. So uh, let's show you the converter first. On the back, we've got a connection here, and this is for the antenna. That's our first connection. And right next to that, that's the connector that you would normally put into the TV. But what we're going to do is we're going to connect that to the VCR. So we already have this pre-connected. The top one is in. That's where the signal comes in. The bottom is where it comes out. So we're going to connect this back here. I'm just going to do a soft connect so we're not spending too much time on that. Now we're going to come out of the VCR into the TV, and right here we already have it connected. So that's how we're getting our signal from here to here to there. Now we're going to turn this around, and since we're uh, downstairs in our studio, we probably can't get a signal in here. But what I want to show people is that you can get a signal in here. So I recorded some of our WTTW programming. We've got four digital channels, and hopefully it's showing it right now. And so you can test this now. You can actually see the digital channels as we speak because not only are we airing digital, so is channel 5, channel 7, other channels are airing digital. So here's the thing. VCRs, in, at least in the, uh, the Best Buy world, are almost passe. Yeah, they are. I mean, you have digital video recorders now. So, uh, you know, most people, a lot of people aren't using VCRs, but we still have a large number of our viewers that use VCRs. There's nothing wrong with them. You can still get a signal. You can still record the channel. Um, the, uh, the one thing uh, that is kind of the, the downside of a VCR is that this has an analog tuner. And because it has an analog tuner, after February 17th of 2009, you're not going to be able to get that signal. Can I bypass this whole thing, just go buy a new VCR and forget about the rest of this? Well, you have two options there. You can get what's called a DVD recorder combo VCR. It's two units in one. That's going to cost you about $280 to $300. Um, on the market, well, what's supposed to come on the market is a standalone VCR, much like this one that has a digital tuner in it. I believe it's going to be made by JVC. But that VCR is going to retail for about $130. So, you know, you could buy a VCR a couple of years ago for $40 or $50, right. even cheaper than that. So, it, you know, it kind of doesn't make it worth it. But again, you can still do this hookup with the VCR. The only big downside with this is timed, record, timed recordings are going to be kind of tough. You can't. So I can't watch this and record another show at the same time? Not with the setup we have right now. Whatever this tuner is switched on, you're going to have to watch that and you're going to have to record that as well. If you add another tuner into the mix, then you can watch and record the same thing. But, you know, now you've got tons of connections. Well, and I mean, and that's sort of the thing. I mean, you've got all of these different things. If I just went and bought, this may be a really stupid <laughs> question, so, so I apologize in advance, but if I went and bought one of those new little flat screen TVs, mm -hmm. do I have any of these problems? No, because the flat screen TVs, now it depends on, it depends on where you buy it. You have to make sure that it has a digital tuner in it. And but could APS I hook the tuner. flat screener screen to my old VCR and not you, have to deal with that little box? You, you could, yes, because now you have a digital tuner, but now the problem is that the resolution from the VCR is nowhere near what you would get on a digital TV. The resolution is so much better than a VCR that it actually is going to look worse on that flat panel television than it is on this little 13-inch, <laughs> 20-year-old television. Well, there's no justice in that. <laughs> there's none. So if, then I have to, for a lot of people who still have a ton mm -hmm. of these tapes around, right. they do need their VCR. Yeah, I mean, uh, there are, you can get the DVD 
DVD recorder with the VCR, and then you're able to, you know, transfer your VCR recordings onto a DVD, or if you have a computer, you can do it that way. But again, a lot of people just want to be able to record Chicago Tonight. You know, maybe they're not going to be home. And we encourage that. And we do encourage that. And so this setup will ensure that you'll be able to do that. Because otherwise, you just need cash. Yes. <laughs> well, Christian Farr, thank you very much for trying to decode this. You know? We're trying our best, Carol. Good. I know you are. Thanks very <laughs> Thanks much. Thanks a lot. We'll be back in a moment with an American gladiator as our critic for a day, so don't go away.